somewhere? You're in the other room? Okay. You're in here. Okay, what are, what are you doing? I'm doing what you said. I'm, I'm sanding with the light. I didn't mean sand with the light. I meant use the light to see where you need to sand. Just stop. Ah, oh, just give me that. Give me that. Okay. Oh, that, that's, that's not what I meant. I didn't mean... Look what you've done to the wall. Look what you've done to it. Huh. Just, okay, just stop there and listen for a second. I, I should have been more clear. I didn't actually want you to use the light to sand with. I wanted you to hold the light up close to your drywall and see any spots that might need to be sanded. Okay, let me see if I can get this out. The reason I wanted you to do that, I guess I should have been more clear, is if you just look at that wall without a light, you'll think it's pretty good, but when you look at it at closer inspection with a light on, you'll see all sorts of little imperfections that either need to be filled or sanded out. So, that's what I was saying. I, I Oh, I can't believe you were actually using the light to say... Well, that's what you said. You said, go in and use the light to sand with. And that's what I was doing. I was following directions. Yeah, I know you were... You were following directions, but... Okay, uh, tell you what. I'm going to do this for now, and uh, can you just go and clean up and, and sweep up, sweep the floor, and and get all that stuff done for now and I'll, I'll carry on with this, okay? Okay, I'll, I'll go do that. Okay, thanks. Yeah, and I'll just, I'll just explain here what needs to be done. So, yeah, uh, that's what happens when, you know, and I've done that before, I don't explain myself very well, so I end up in trouble. Uh, okay, so as you can see here, I'll put the light up here, I see some areas that need to be, that need to be uh, fixed. Uh, and the light's really good. You can go along all your work and see any areas that are that require a bit more work before you get into priming. So, um, yeah. Okay, I see a little spot there. And it's not too bad. I can, this is going to be sanded out. What I did here this morning was I found some spots and uh, and I filled them a bit. So this this area actually needs to be sanded again. Let's see what's over here. Uh, some areas here, you can see where I put the light, there's some areas here that need to be filled. And I filled a few small areas here this morning. And yeah, and I filled up here, you can see right there where I filled that this morning. And that's dry now so I can sand that out. When you sand with a light you get to see everything. Just the light sand. And if I was a real drywaller, I probably wouldn't have to sand much at all. But I am a self admitted novice drywaller. And. But I've got it. I've got it. I've got all this done. And I'm going through it. So. You take your time and be careful. You can still make a mess. <laughs> yeah, I can see here now some stuff that I didn't. Uh, I thought was okay. Look right here. See some spots there. Just gentle. I'm not pushing very hard. Just a little like that. It's kind of dark in the house here, so the light actually really it makes it almost better to have the room dark and then use a light if you can manage like that, because then that you really see it. You really see the, the spots that need work. There's a little there. Just some, nothing much there, minor scratches. I filled a bit of it this morning, like I say, and it's dry now, so. Yeah, not a lot to do. Uh, these corners here, I filled these this morning. 
sit right there. See here are some places I added a little mud this morning. That may not be quite 100% dry. That's coming off. I think it's okay. There. Ah, you get the idea. See that? So that's still not bad. I can get the edge off there. Edge off that. There, just a bit. Bit of a touch up. Yeah, a little bit there. Something like that. Yeah. Oh, some, you can see where the bubbles are in here. There was some bubbles in the mud when I put it on. See there. That's okay. A little bit of an edge there. Now the whole thing is, is there's, you know, there's the pros sand very little or not at all. You know, if they can get away with, you know, next to no sanding at all, maybe just a little touch, and guy like me, I'm not an expert, I'm, I'm a novice, I'm, I'm learning, but what I have learned is, you know, if it, if it does take me, you know, going back and touching up and, you know, if I have to do that several times, then, then I'm, that's what I have to do. I mean, I'm not going to get, I'm not going to be an expert in, uh, you know, just having done a few houses. you got to you better take your time and you know and I think the the biggest lesson for me in this is is uh, not rushing it you know just realizing that you know you come in one day with the idea that you're gonna put on the primer today and but if you go around with the light and you see stuff that needs your attention you know I just realize I have to stop and and go through it again you know and and when I come back, you know, the when it's dry and it's handed out, if I see another little spot, you know, if it's if it's something I don't think is going to be covered with the primer, then I'm, I'm just going to keep going. I'm going to see that's not dry there. I put that on this morning. That's not dry there yet at all. And uh, yeah, you just got to be ready to come back and and keep just keep making uh, small improvements until. Do you get it? Do you get it fixed? Do you get it right? You know, because there's nothing worse than you know thinking you've finished it and you have to get primed and then painted and then realize that it's a mess. You know, that you got to see everything. You got to see all the places that you should have put a little more effort into after it's painted. You don't want that. And like the, the title of the video says, you know, there's the right way and the wrong way. And I think I've shown you both. <laughs> maybe I'm showing you. Maybe I'm still showing you the wrong way. I don't know. But uh, we're getting there. The light can be both your friend and your enemy. <laughs> the light will show all your mistakes, but it's your friend because it lets you find them and fix them. Yeah. Yeah, and just before I go, I should tell you that there's a there's a helper. That guy I had helping me there, he uh, he's coming up uh, available for work if you want him, want to hire him. He's uh, I think I've uh, I think I've had enough. <laughs> uh, what's his name? I forget his name. Even yeah. Uh, well, he was only following my instructions, right? Mm -hmm. 